Well, yeah, I've so got this uh, brass locomotive, uh, excuse me, brass caboose here, and uh, this is a uh, uh, United uh, Denver Rear Grand caboose. PFM, made back in the early 60s, HON3, and they would, you can put Mark. Uh, you have the, uh, you ought to put the, on the proper HON3 couplers, if you mm -hmm, like, mm -hmm. yeah, you yeah. know, and usually we, they've got painted up with the uh, uh, Herald on, I believe. Well, we could do this in the Denver and Rio Grande, too, and uh, even that'd be the pre-Herald days. Yeah. And then what I'd like to do is I'd like to put one of those little, you know, the box lights they had on the roof. Can do that. Yeah, can precision that. scale. Can precision scale, or yeah. we can drill it out and LED it. Yeah. Well, that'd be great. That's exactly sure. what I want to do. Okay. So what are the first steps in, in, uh, in uh, working with this? First of all, it has to be taken apart, and I put it in a cleaning solution, and then I put it in a bead blaster to get the satin sheen on it. Then it is primed, and then painted, you know, your scale coat, flow color, flow quill, true color, etc. You know, we pick the right shade, you pick the shade. And then, of course, it's decal, and then flat finish if you want to weather it. If you can weather it, we usually do pastel weather. So cool. Well, let's get started on it. All right. I'll write up a ticket right now.